Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Jamo here bringing you episode number 5 of my 15 career mode with Chelsea. And the first game within this episode, the second game of the Premier League season is a game at home to Leicester. Um, I'm just going to quickly sort the team out, which I virtually think is alright anyway. Costa, Hazard, Schürrle, Oscar, Matic, Ramirez, Cher. There we go. Cher had a decent debut against Burnley, but Burnley were an absolute rock at the back. Um, I'm going to bring Fabregas back into the team this time and play William out on the right instead of Schürrle. Um, just to give them a bit of a rest. Um, let's make those changes. Okay. Let's jump into this game against Leicester. Um, yeah, so I'll let you run through this game. And I'll speak to you after. Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of the Premier League. Today it's Chelsea against Leicester City. Let's go off to Stamford Bridge. It's a perfect day for watching football. Lovely, clear conditions. Your commentary team is Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Well, we've got Barclays Premier League action for you. I'm Martin Tyler and with me is Alan Smith. Yeah, hi Martin. Great to be here. Chelsea looking to get more points this time than they did in the last game. They got one and it was away from home against Burnley. No, I mean, a bit unlucky in the nil-nil draw. Forwards had plenty of chances. I think they'll make amends with a win today. Belgium very much a team, and the individuals didn't flourish too readily in their cause. And Hazard perhaps was one who suffered a little bit more than most. Here's the chance. They've still got an opportunity here after the goalkeeper parried it. I think so, and it was a poor tackle, it was badly timed. this one penalty given no booking he's got away with that I think he got up and he's looked to the ref thinking for all the world like he would see a yellow card so yeah he's uh, he's escaped punishment luckily so from my book Taking a chance when you hit it that hard, but well, he kept his nerve and found the bottom left. Well, let's take another look at the goal. And the 
scoreline is 2-1. Brilliant technique in the tackle. And the shot's on! Decent effort. Well, this is half-time, that's the whistle. And 2-1 is the score at this stage. Well, we wondered whether there might be an upset here, but the side that are really the favoured side are very much on the front foot and on the right side of the scoreline. He's taken on his man and beaten him. Supporting player alongside. In with a chance. Oh. And he goes for goal. And that levels it up. It's a goal. That was a goal of deluxe class. Well, you've got to ask questions to the defence because they just didn't follow in there. Well, they want to see this again, this goal. It's level again after that goal, but who knows what's going to happen now. Diego Costa. Well, Leicester City have got something to hang on to here. Allen. Well, it's going to be a question of... Michael Oliver, the referee, has stopped the play. Cards out here from the referee after going back to the earlier incident. Yeah, good play from the ref. He gave that move a chance to develop, but uh, it came to an end. And, uh, I think he had to. He had to book him. His job is to sit in front of the back four and really help the defence, but it's not been that kind of game, has it? And he's been moved around a bit. He's off now anyway. Well, he has. I mean, the opposition, in fairness, have played really well and passed it around him, but... Got to be! He's scored a second goal here, and he's showing his new fans what he's made of. Yeah, he's, he's settling in and looking better and better by the match, and this couple of goals won't do him any harm at all. Diego Costa, he's just shaped his body there beautifully to stroke it into the bottom left. Good look here, again, by the replay of the goal. about football isn't it we've got the team leading the fans cheering and the other team giving everything to try and spoil the party well the way this uh, away team are pushing I can see them getting an equaliser it's a quick break and he's beyond his man easily enough in with the chance getting that first goal really mattered he's added two more now for a hat-trick he's a huge favourite of the fans already and why not when you can convert a hat-trick like this in the style that he has great day for him really front of goal, super efficient for his hat-trick. Yeah, one of those days he'll look back on with such fondness. And the score now is 4-2. Good link-up. Opportunity here, here's the chance. One of the best finishers on the pitch at the moment and he wasn't at his best then and the defenders were well they were poor and lucky yeah and it's a collector's item to see the lad miss from that kind of distance and there we are 4-2 the final score as the referee calls the hall
up next in the English Premier League. In third place, Liverpool are at home to 17th place, Aston Villa. And there is the half time whistle, nil nil at the break. Popov, Nathan Dyer working hard just to see maybe a sight of goal. Lost his marker cleverly. And here's the shot. What a moment for him on his debut for his new club. It's a super goal. Well, it's the perfect start, isn't it? And that'll give him so much confidence for the weeks ahead. Oh, they have taken the lead here. That's amazing. No one's given them a chance, really. No, they've hung in there in this match, and fair play to them. They've taken the one chance, one of the few chances that they had. Well, how on earth did he manage to squeeze it in from there? That was wonderful. Pop off. The Swansea City, a change coming up. In quickly. Daniel Costa! And that's a goal for the new man. And he's taken it very well. I'd be delighted to pull off the mark so early on in the season here and uh, I'll give him a lot of confidence going forward. The goal from Diego Costa, well, it is an open goal. But he had to keep his concentration, and he did the simple thing well. We're all level again. 1-1 the score. Well, the building steadily here, working away. Diego Costa. The shot. All action from him and two goals to reward him for his efforts. Well, he's got the potential to be a huge favourite with these fans and with his new teammates as well. Well, you can't finish them more precisely than that. No, no stopping that one the way he struck it. Here's the goal again. Climax to an exciting game. This could be the decider. Yeah, it could be at this stage of the match. There doesn't seem much of. There's the final whistle. It's a win for Chelsea. Ladies and gentlemen, a message. Well, guys, yet another win um, in a rather bizarre game. Um, because Swansea opened the scoring with a goal from a really tight angle. And then Diego Costa managed to score a goal pretty much the side of his head. Um, and then Diego Costa pops up again with the winner at the last minute. We're pretty much the last kick of the game. Next up is our next uh, bit of action, really, is the transfer dead Monday, which we'll have at the start of next episode. So I want to get your guys' feedback on the first five episodes. And also, our next game is a game in the second round of the Capital One Cup against Tottenham Hotspur. A game I was going to try and do live. Um, so I hope you can join me in for that one guys. Thank you for watching episode 5 and I'll see you in episode 6 soon for the Capital One Cup. See you later.